Hello and welcome back everyone. Hans Wolf here with even more Star Wars The Old Republic. Playing as Caiaphas Kane here, my Jedi Knight. And we are halfway through exploring the Black Sun's territory. One of the, one of the lower sectors of Coruscant. They've managed to take over and push security out. We do need to still rendezvous with this security force who's hopefully going to help us rescue Dr. Tarnas. At the same time, we have this snitch in one of their cantinas. Hopefully, they won't cause a fuss. Oh, yes, and a security captain we met outside of the Hydra Supply has asked us to go into another section, another district of the territory and disarm various bombs that are being disguised in Republic supply crates. Okay, before we actually start doing that though, we did get a, yeah, a law object on the Black Sun themselves. They are known as a powerful crime syndicate that rose to prominence on Coruscant in the latter days of the war. Taking advantage of the chaos and rioting in the city after the planet's sacking, several gangsters joined forces and began seizing control of lower city neighborhoods. The origin of the syndicate's name is unclear, but a common phrase among despairing Coruscant citizens was better a black sun than none. Alas, hopes that the black sun would bring order instead of anarchy died quickly. For the black sun, the rioting and looting never really stopped. Although the gangsters have profitable spice and weapons trafficking operations, their numbers, or members, almost to a man, have an extraordinary taste for violence. Civilians are extorted until they have nothing left to extort. Afterwards, they're either used for target practice. Oh, sorry, they are used for target practice. City blocks are incinerated just for the pleasure of their demolitionists. Despite the efforts of the Justicar's Brigade, Black Sun has become a force to be reckoned with. The Republic Senate has begun to realize the threat Black Sun represents, but with the Syndicate's influence already beginning to stretch beyond Coruscant, stopping it may be impossible. Lovely. And considering the Black Sun still operate 3,500 years later, yeah. They're going to exist in one form or another. We do have the Hydro Supply repaired. We do have the Calvin Bills to implicate Senator Dodd in his corruption. Okay. Let's head deeper into Black Sun territory once again. Since we're here, and there's no other reason not to do this now, we might as well pop our head into the Silent Sun Cantina. We do have, it looks like an Endurance Datacron, just on the ledge there. You can start as a set of crates here, it will allow you to jump up onto this platform, follow this pipe, cross over, follow that pipe. And I believe following this all the way around may lead you onto either this platform or this platform here. And then you can drop down or run along to get the Statacron. Right, so we are looking for the Snit, who is hiding somewhere here, trying to keep a low profile. You look somewhat shifty, like you're nervous. I'm here to pick up the recordings you have for Deuce Everton. You want to spray paint that on the walls or anything? A little discretion here. 
Tell Dooch it's just what he asked for. Enough for the Republic to make arrests. Black Sun, the real stuff. Hope they can make it stick. This is Coruscant. You shouldn't have to be afraid for your life just because you get off the wrong elevator. Excellent. That was nice and straightforward. Now in the next neighborhood is where we have those sabotaged supply crates. What's that, Jürgen? The Black Sun gangsters are everywhere, indeed. We are looking for their gang leaders as well. Two of three gang leaders. We have a gunslinger and a gang leader here. Okay, that's the third stage of the bonus mission complete. The final stage is to deactivate a security console. Now, if I remember correctly, that security console is also where the Black Sun have moved their stolen goods. So we'll be heading there before long. data station might as well help ourselves the more credits while we can Jürgen where are you ah Jürgen's got himself stuck excellent there's all the supply crates we need to disarm I'm sure some other respectable Republic fellow will uh, do their own deeds. Ooh, a companion gift. Some crafting materials. Good day. Well, a Jedi. You don't stand out from all the lowlifes down here at all, do you? I'm Phalaris. I think you and I should have a private chat. What can I do for you? There's a rumor going around that Black Sun's about to clean house. Snitches, rival gang leaders, they're all gonna be dead meat. There's a list of these unfortunate individuals sitting on their computers. I need those names. How did you acquire such knowledge? Anonymous sources, who need to stay that way. I can slice into Black Sun's computers and get the hit list, but they'll be able to trace me. So while I'm slicing in, I need someone to break into the Black Sun hideout and shut down their tracing equipment. Think you can do that? You really want to put your life in my hands to get this list? Don't have much choice, do I? I need that list, and I need it yesterday. Time to make this happen. All right, go. Go! Okay, we can certainly look into that. In fact, I believe we're having 
the head in the Black Sun headquarters anyway. Just give us maybe five, ten minutes before you start. We should... Yeah, no, that's fine. So this is where we were meant to meet up with that special security force. Oh shit, we have Blackstone actually attacking. Seems like they weren't exactly keeping a low profile here. Corporal, get a culto pack on that man. The rest of you prep for evac. Agent Galen sent me. What's happened? Black Sun. They're not a gang anymore, they're an army. We were securing a perimeter around their base for you. They hit back with military-grade weapons. Killed six of my men. Seven, sir. Joran's gone. We're not equipped for this fight. Not anymore. We can't help you. No need to panic. We'll figure something out. All due respect, you don't have a clue what you're up against. We've been fighting Black Sun for months. Now with new weapons and armor, they're unstoppable. <laughs> Look at us, we're half dead. And they didn't suffer a single casualty. There's no hope of victory. If you surrender now, your soldiers will have died in vain. Is that what you want? What about the man inside that base waiting to be rescued? You'd abandon him? This is a moment of truth, Sergeant. Do you give up and let evil win? Or stand up and fight? I'll go with you. But I won't ask my men to follow. You don't have to. The Jedi's right. We can't let those scum beat us. Count me in. Always wanted to fight alongside a Jedi. You'll need to take down the base's security network so we can get inside. Once the network's down, we'll attack the back entrance. You take the front. We'll rendezvous in the base. Be strong, all of you. I'll see you on the inside. Let's double time it, men. Move, move. I hope you know what you're doing. Yeah, so do I. To be fair, we've been dealing with the Black Sun all the way through their territory. Unless they've got something unexpected within their headquarters, we'll be able to manage, I believe. It's good that we were able to encourage, inspire our security forces. It would have sucked to have stormed that headquarters alone. So we do have various... What's that? Yeah, the Black Sun are attacking everyone. We have these four security terminals to give our security forces a fighting chance. Here, of course, is Black Sun Headquarters. Is there a bonus for dealing with the Black Sun here? These are only droids, but... Yeah, we need to deal with 10 of the Black Sun.
We have a fellow knight who's also looking to rescue Dr. Tarnas. find Dr. Tarnas and find this Black Sun leader, this Salar, who ordered the attack. Before we head in the Black Sun headquarters, of course, we have their stolen goods and that security console. <laughs> yep, indeed, this is all the stolen merchandise, Jurgen. all these supplies that the SIS know where it's located. And now we just need a tag. Sorry. Slice into this security console. And we make a new friend. Just gained. Ooh, they had a shipping manifest containing near priceless goods. Probably their next targets. Experience booster came to an end. Might as well pop another one, why not? And in the Black Sun headquarters we go. This is the, the computer lab where they'll be tracking that woman's slicing activities. Last but not least. Excellent. Okay. Now we need to head deeper into the headquarters map.
Tarnus, we risked everything for you. Stealing those data files, faking your kidnapping. This is how you repay us? You were compensated with enough weapons and armor to make Black Sun invincible. Invincible? There's a Jedi carving up my base. This is your fault. We never should have trusted a Sith. If a Jedi has come for you, Salar, it wasn't my doing. I thought your kidnapping was a little too convenient. I would have preferred a more graceful exit, but your masters forced my hand. I have no time for this nonsense. Finish your pointless battle. Coruscant's fate is already sealed. Surrender, you scum! We got you surrounded! Nice of you to join the party. Wouldn't miss it. Kill them all! Yeah. Playing as a Jedi Shadow with Jedi Knight cutscenes. Hmm. We may have a... Uh, moments of... Hilarity. <laughs> or confusion. Or both! Can't believe it! We just took down Salar. Black Sun won't forget that anytime soon. We lost some good soldiers, but this victory gives their deaths meaning. Your men fought bravely. You should be proud. Thanks for leading this mission. Black Sun will have reinforcements here soon. Any sign of the man you came to rescue? There you are. We intercepted Solar's holocaul to Tarnus. Can't believe he's a Sith. But that's not the worst news. The planet prison prototype here at the lab? A fake. Tarnus stole the real planet prison. Tarnus has been playing us from the start. Playtime's over. Let's find that traitor. We need you back at the Senate Tower. Kira out. Sounds like your work is just starting. We won't hold you up. Goodbye, Jedi. It's been a pleasure to work with you, Sergeant. Troopers, keep on the good work. Ah, great. Great, 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 great. Tarnus. He was a Sith all along. And somehow he's managed to move the Planet Prison prototype. The fact that he mentioned that Coruscant's fate is already sealed makes me somewhat nervous. Since I haven't been visited by any large, angry Black Sun thugs, I take it you got everything taken care of? It's going to be okay now. <sighs> Alright, that's great news. What a relief. Here, something for your trouble. I can't thank you enough for your help. You know, it's funny. There are people who would pay a frigate load of credits for this list. So, you had an ulterior motive all along. No, it's nothing like that. I was just thinking it'd be nice to make a little something extra, wouldn't it? I say we seize this opportunity while we can. That list should be used to save lives. You just don't give in, do you? Oh, you're right. I shouldn't be looking for a quick profit. I'll make sure the list ends up in the right hands. Lives are more important than credits, anyhow. See you around, then. Thanks again for all your help. Ah, level 24. Was it level 27 for our next jump? Yes, it is.
Stand by for examination and suggested products. You are fit for duty. Return to your post. Haven't heard an explosion in a good while. Guess that means you defuse those crates. I think I found them all. Let's hope Black Sun doesn't get any more. We'll make sure. No more people will be killed looking for food. Now, I'm no rich senator, but let me give you a little something for taking care of this. Recognition. It's a generous offer, but I can't accept. Rare to find someone not out to make a profit. You probably have other business, so I won't keep you. Watch your back out there. Good to see you again. But I don't think the Black Sun feels the same way. <laughs> okay, so we need to head back to the staging point. Let's just quick travel back over to there. We have the information that the snitch give us. Let's hand that over. Lobak says the recordings in here should be enough to make arrests. And we have the shipping manifests. There you go. I guess word has got around and this security officer would like to now have a word with us. Jedi, I haven't seen one of you guys in ages. Not that I'm surprised, this place is a mess. I used to be proud to say Lieutenant Dorn, Chorus and Security Forces. These days it's just a job. It doesn't even pay the bills. You should be proud of what you do. Right now I'm just trying to keep my head above the garbage. Now some stupid hollow disk was stolen, and the commander wants me to deal with it. I don't have the manpower to recover stolen intelligence. I, I can't just pull a commando unit out of my helmet, can I? What exactly was stolen? Here's the deal. You probably don't know them, but there's these weird secret passages running all over the planet. The funny thing is, we didn't even know about these passages until the schematics were stolen off an old data bank. Someone should have realized how important the schematics were. Tell me about it. Now I gotta deal with someone else's mistake. But the schematics weren't taken by some gutter thief. They were taken by the blasted Justicars. Crazy vigilantes. The Justicars are armed to the teeth. Most of my security officers just flat out refuse to tangle with them. Sometimes it's necessary to risk ourselves for the greater good. That's easy for a Jedi to say. My men don't see fighting the Justicars as a risk. They see it as suicide. There's another detail. We don't know where the Justicars took the stolen schematics. An agent from the Strategic Information Service was assigned to track the thieves, but she hasn't reported back in. Stolen schematics and a missing spy? How much are you asking me to do? Take it easy. I'm sure the spy's fine. She just might be able to help you track down the schematics. Her name is Feeler Dan. A little old and a little batty, if you ask me. Feeler's last known location was in Justicar territory. If she's done her job, she should know where to find those schematics. Time to find out if this spy knows her business. Now keep in mind, worthless as they may be, we're under strict orders to make sure these schematics aren't leaked to anyone. So after you find old lady Feeler and recover the schematics, you make sure to bring them directly back to me. That's critical. I see. So, who else do we need to speak to now? That's fine, that's fine. Yeah. We're gonna sell us over to the Senate Tower. And then we'll backtrack. That's the second time we've heard of these Justicars. We heard about them in the Black Sun Codex, the Justicar Brigade. But it seems they are crazy vigilantes? Huh. I brought what you asked.
Curious that they give these senators new animations. I think it used to be Senator Dodd who used to walk off. The reason I mention that, of course, is the Ugnaught and Senator there were like, sitting here in this little chamber. And when the Ugnaught would ask uh, the Senator to excuse himself, he would walk off into this chamber here. I guess some people didn't see that quest was available so they moved them to a more visible location within the tower itself we might as well report the situation to general varsufra at least he's still around even though our jedi master's buggered off Sith, working as my chief scientist. How can I defend the Republic if I can't trust my own people? Tarnus's entire engineering team vanished along with the planet prison. They're all traitors too. The Sith want us to panic. Don't give in to fear. Tarnus will use the planet prison against Coruscant. He could trap us here forever, paralyze the Republic by holding us hostage. You're our only hope of stopping that. Don't tell me I'm the only Jedi on Coruscant. Your masters are in hyperspace. You and Kira are the only Jedi with the Council's authorization. For good reason. We're both amazing. I just traced that hollow call we intercepted from the Black Sun base. Tarnus was communicating from down in Sector 439. Justicar territory. Tarnus knows we're not welcome there. Justicars are paramilitary vigilantes. They took over a sector, cut ties with the rest of Coruscant, and they don't like visitors. If their leaders understood the situation, they'd work with us. We have no way to contact them and no time for diplomacy. Justicars are well trained and armed, but they don't concern me. It's the Sith Lord I'm worried about. You shouldn't face Tarnus alone. I may only be a Padawan, but I can help you. What do you think, General? An excellent idea. In fact, I insist you take her. Stop Tarnus before he uses the planet prison against us. The fate of the Republic rests on your shoulders, Jedi. May the Force be with you. Okay. We have a codex entry on Padawan Kira Carson here. I wonder if just a cause no that Tarnus is a Sith. And what he's up to. Have they accepted him into their territory? Do they even know what he's planning? What are you standing around for? Stop Tarnus before it's too late! Great. So, Kira also wields a double-bladed lightsaber. We'll have a look at her codex entry at the beginning of the next part. For now, let's go report to the Gree representatives that the hydro supply is repaired. And likely hear about another one of their developing or repair situations. Coruscant systems indicate clean life waters flow upward. You flawlessly applied my crafted solution to the hydro supply at the black sun level below. Adulation. I'm glad to have been a part of it. You are unmarred by black sun green perpendiculars. I am gratified by this. Clean life waters flow and nurture upper levels. The Coruscant sufferer beings achieve benefits on the Enclave's Gree ingenuity. My black sphere evolves to a purple parallel because of you. When I impart this development, Padake will progress enthusiasm with the Senator. You guys like things to be parallel, don't you? 
Your comprehension of Gree linguistics progresses favorably. You evolve accurate insights. I pledged you a piece of Gree ingenuity. This solution was crafted specifically for your being. My acknowledgement and appreciations. I continue upgrading cores and systems and ensure the clean life waters flow upward. Accept my unyielding gratefulness. You are very welcome. Ooh. We gained a fancy belt for our trouble. What does this belt look like? Hmm. Yeah, I do like this armor. I might have to grab the ambitious armor set again. <laughs> the clean life waters flow upward, and my black sphere achieves purple parallel because of you. Gratefulness, Black Bisector. Again, you are welcome. I'm here to help. Is there anything I can do? Operator units always inherit fouled labors. I administrate as well as Patake, but I am marooned to waste processing. What have I done to incur white acute? Is that what you are? An operator unit? You submit curiosity. Bewildering. Foreign species customarily embody flawless self-centeredness. Gree units fulfill four cast assignments. Crafter, Operator, Researcher, and Administrator. I am Operator. I ensure proper function of Gree Ingenuity. Hatake is Administrator Unit. His sole aptitude is Communication Command Governance Argument. I can serve Patake's function. Can he serve mine? No. How do you know you can do Patake's job? I share aptitude for Communication Command Governance Argument. Operator cast was compelled to me, not programmed at origin. Patake commanded me. Optimize Coruscant's waste processing system. Preserve your organs from filth, disease, poisons. But Ugnot porcine bipeds plunder Gree ingenuity from waste processors. With Gree optimization solutions stolen, filth, disease, poisons spread uncontrolled. Plagues imminent. We need to act now before it's too late. You comprehend the volatility of this predicament. You exhibit enhanced insight for your species. The Ugnot porcine bipeds plundered Gree optimization solution unaware of internal transmitters. I detect the plundered device's coordinates. Hatake authorizes compensation of Republic credits to the Black Bisector who repossesses the optimization solution. I suppose I can do that much for you. That is the expected response, Black Bisector. Why exhaust respiratory functions on it? Thanks. I am Hibarak, Operator Unit. If you seek Orange Vertex, schedule with Patake, Administrator Unit. Yeah, you sound very disappointed with your position in life. Spend many a year in customer services in some job opposition, and you'll begin to sound like that. So there's one last thing we need to do, and that is speak to Agent Yorkson about the stolen gut. I heard you sent the Black Suns packing. Have you tracked down where they took the cargo yet? I've brought what you requested. I'll send a security cleaning crew down there immediately. Then we can try to patch up this operation. Okay. Um, let's see. Let's just park ourselves here, why not? We'll take a small break. Thank you all for joining me once again. When we come back, we'll look, the, we'll look at the Codex entry on Padawan Kira Carson here, who has been somewhat thrust upon us, and then we're heading over to the sector that the Justicars have taken over and have pushed Republic security out of. Learn more about these Justicars and any, any developing situations there. As I say, thank you all for joining me. Feel free to leave a comment if you so wish. 
and hopefully I'll see you for even more next time. Until then, though, take care. Bye-bye now.